Hi everybody, this is Dana and I'm going to be doing a quick review on my perfume that I promised a couple days ago. Sorry, it's been really busy and I haven't been able to get to it. But I'm going to review mine. I can't, I don't have time to go over the notes and everything. Um, sorry about that light in the background, but um, this is the best setup I could do for now until I have my new office. So, until we move. So, first of all, um, I'm going to go over mine and then I will go over my husband's, which are absolutely absolutely a chicken fried nightmare he has so many clones and uh, anyway so yeah first of all I thought I'd show you I'm wearing my high-low dress and one of my favorite necklaces this is just really really chunky and it has a, a cross on it and then I'm just wearing it with um, with a, a jean jacket so it's really cute um, I can't show you the bottom part I have boots on with it but yeah anyway so let's get started so first of all, I've had to start this about three times because I forgot stuff in the bedroom. Um, some of them came with sets. So um, anyway, first of all, I would say my favorite one is my the, the Fame. It's a toss-up between the Fame and the Viva La Juicy and the Nicki Minaj and the Aqualina. But anyway, so this came in the, the 3.7 ounce of Fame and I was told that it stains. It doesn't stain. Let me spray it one more time. I've sprayed it three times. So I'll spray it on my hand and you can see it does not stain. There's no black. So this was in the um, Juicy Couture, or not Juicy, this was in the Glossy Mag on one of the pages if you want to read about it. Um, there's a whole page about Lady Gaga and her fame scent and how it's a wintry scent and it's really, it's got a lot of lavender and bergamot and it's a very famous fragrance this year. Um, I think this one's just really going to hit the top. The, the charts. So this came with a 3.7. It came with, I haven't opened all of it yet. It came with a one ounce. They're all perfumes. They're, sorry about the lighting. And I think I got it for 25 or something. Block the light out. Sorry. That light in the kitchen needs to be shut out, dear. It's really just shining. So there's that. And then it came with these artificial nails, which I will never wear. Maybe I'll sell them or something. Um, so there's that. And then this was stuck to the purse. Thank you, dear. So anyway, I didn't pay $79 for it. I got, um, I had some special coupons because my, anyway, I had friends and family coupons from Macy's. But anyway, it came with these. I will never wear these. So I have to make this kind of quick. And then I, all my jewelry is hanging from the side. I will do a jewelry review on a separate um, video. But I have tons of it. It's I have long. I mean, it's insane. This is, this is all my jewelry or more. And I've got all different kinds. I've got my Juicy Couture. And there's just tons. I wear really bulky jewelry. Um... There's just everything. So this is where I've been hanging it for now. There's one with a perfume ball inside of it. I love this one. Silver. Anyway, so I'm not here to review my jewelry right now. So what else came with the... This is a fame. It came with these two. I don't know if you can see them on the table. It came with those two. Sorry about the shaking of the laptop. And then it came with the fingernails, and then it came with this purse. I took this back. Um, I'm going to do a what's in my purse later. I picked out a new purse at, at Macy's. This one's a little more scratched than the first one, but that's okay. I think it's going to get scratched up carrying it around. So anyway, there's the fame. As I take them out, I think I'm going to just leave them to the side. So then next, I'm going to review the my second favorite is the Viva La Juicy. My husband got me. I reviewed this the other day. Um, let me adjust the lighting behind. Um, yeah, this is beautiful. Um, I need to really watch myself so I don't waste it. It's really expensive. I think this was 93 It's insane. So it came with this. And then it came with the Viva La Juicy um, lotion, which I put the pr fragrance on first and the lotion over it after that. And that tends to carry it better than putting the the lotion on and then the fragrance. So um, anyway, that's how I do it. 
when I tried it that way this morning. And then that one came with, what else? That, and then it came with a little tiny, really cute um, perfume size for special occasions or put it in your purse. And this is like a 1.7 fluid ounce. And this is perfume. So there's that. Really cute. Okay, so then I've got the Nicki Minaj. We'll do this one. I love this one. I This is like my third bottle. I love the shape. I just think it's kind of cute. And uh, this is 3.7 ounce. So that came with this. And it came in this really cute box. I'm going to review everything in the box. It came in this box. I, I, when I saw the size, I was like, what is that? It was in a huge Macy's box. And I'm like, what is that? So... Yeah, this is a box. I think I'm going to save it. So for now, I have all my body sprays in there and in more perfume. So I'm going to review this too today, hopefully. So there's that. Anyway, so this, and then it came with the body lotion. And then it came with the hairspray, which is a very light. It doesn't have a lot of alcohol in it. So, like, when you walk by somebody, they can just kind of get a light whiff of your hair. Um, and my husband likes my hair to smell good, so I use these a lot. Um, you just kind of, after you style it, you just take it really lightly, um, spray your hair. I have a hair piece in, so I don't want to get anything on it, because that ruins those, if you get anything on your hair pieces. So there's those three. That came in a set. Okay, then we'll go through my skull, my Ed Hardy Skulls and Roses. Now, this came with quite a few things. This came with a lot of people. Now, I would have probably never picked this out. My husband picked it out for me. I did, I, I'm a big sucker for packaging, and I probably would have never looked, looked at this, but this comes out of the mouth, but that's not that big of a deal. Most people don't come in your home and see what your packaging looks like, but I've gotten more compliments from this. It smells fabulous. Let me spray it on the other hand. I don't want to waste it, but um, I'm not going to give you the notes on everything, but this smells really, really good. Got to let it dry down. It smells very feminine, very feminine, and it dry. It has a lot of vanilla in it, but I just love it. It smells so good. My husband has one just like it, only it's black. Now, yeah, the packaging is not real appealing. I'm not sure why they did this for women, but anyway, it's, it's called Skulls and Roses by Ed Hardy, and this came with the body lotion. Let me get you a better shot of that. Came with the body lotion, the bottom. I had to go get this out of the shower, the bath and shower gel. This came with a big set. It was probably pretty expensive. And then it, I carry this in my purse. It came with this really cute little, yeah, it's got a skull on the top. This is perfume, the pure, the pure perfume. So is the skull. Everything he got me is a pure perfume, which is really nice. This is not cologne. This is 3.7 ounce. This is a perfume. So there's that. Oops. Dropped my Nicki Minaj. I can't get it. Anyway, so there's that. Okay, then next. the Everything he got me pretty much came with a set. Then I got the Aqualina. This from him. This came off the off of a website. This is a tester. You can get these for cheaper if you go on to a search engine and type in uh, Pink Sugar by Aqualina and it will direct you to put in like inexpec inexpensive perfumes or testers or whatever and then it usually comes without the lid. I just save the lid and then when I run out I just get another one and I always have the lid. So anyway it came with or it didn't come with this. It, I got this, the Aqualina, and then my husband ordered the pink sugar hair perfume that goes with it. It comes with all. It comes with body wash, the lotion, whatever. I mean, everything. It comes with a little compact of the draw of the what is it? The kind of um, lotion perfume. Uh, what is it called? solid perfume. I haven't gotten one of those yet. It comes in like swirls. I ordered one once, but it was back ordered. Anyway, so there's that. Aqualina, I wear that just about every day. Okay, then I've got the 
these, sorry about the lighting, lost you there. This is the Love Rocks by, um, this is from Vic Victoria's Secret. Now, they are linked with Bath and Body Works. I don't know if, well, who owns who, but I know that they, the companies are together. So anyway, this Love Rocks, I really, it really appealed to me. It was on their 75 off, and I bought a bunch, and then he got me some. So anyway, for Christmas, but it was fairly expensive. And then when I bought it, I think it was four or five dollars. But I like this little spray thing. It really it goes on like mist. I don't want to spray any more fragrance on me. There's quite a bit on me right now. But so I got this, and then it came with the, the lotion. Now this I think is the one point seven. Yeah. You can't see it. It's 1.7, so that's a little bit smaller. That's the first time he's ever bought that size. And then here's the perf the lotion. And I I'm really strong believer. Ever since I've started wearing lotion with my perfumes, you really need them. This one is called um, Simply Gorgeous, and here's that. This is from Victoria's Secret. There's the name and this comes with another little sprayer. You just twist it to turn it on and it just really very lightly mists you and this is a 3.7. This came with, it didn't come with but this was twenty dollars the Simply Gorgeous fragrance lotion but at the 75 off sale it was like four dollars so there's that. I'm gonna put this back with my lotions for now. Okay, then we have this. This is Sexy Little Things from Victoria's Secret. Smells fabulous. I, I can't give you the notes. Just smells very girly and um, florally, fruity, vanilla, like bergamot, and it's pink. So anyway, there's that. And then I have, this is almost gone, my Vicky Teal Tickled Pink. I got this off of a website, if you can see it right there. It's got little stripes. This is almost gone. I tried to use this up before Christmas just because I know that they get old. This was in a bow. It's pretty much hashed or thrashed. But anyway, there's that. This is 3.7 ounce. Okay, so then we have up here, Heavenly Shine. I have about eight bottles of this. I'm not kidding you that I was going to give for gifts at Christmas, but things fell through. So now I have a lot. Here's a bottle here that's wrapped that didn't get given out. Anyway, there's a bottle behind me that didn't get given out. So anyway, I've got lots of these. So this smells very... I'd have to spray it again on my hand. Let's see here. It smells fruity, very fruity. That's that's way how I would it, describe it. And this is perfume, not cologne. So there's that. Okay, then we've got the good old Tommy Girl. This is really, I wore this out in high school. I really want to get rid of it, and I want to be done with it. So on days that I just feel like I want to wear just what, whatever I don't care about, I just douse myself in this, and I'm hoping that pretty soon it'll be gone. Tommy Girl is just pretty well, I think, had it. You know what I mean? It's like one of those that are, my husband used to wear it. I loved it on him, and he's quit buying it, too. So, anyway, there's that. This is from Bath and Body Works. This is Orange Sapphire. My next love from there is um, Paris Amour. But this one's almost gone, thank goodness. See how much is left. Probably the next spray I'll get rid of it. He's re He really loves the orange and lemons. But I asked him if he wanted it. He said it smelled a little too girly. So anyway, this one's almost gone. And I used to I used to get the Britneys every Christmas. But I figured since I hit 40, um, I should probably stop with the Britneys. This one's called Circus. I used to get the red, the hidden fantasy, the midnight fantasy, but this is the last Britney that I have. This one I can't smell. I got to spray again. Just really doesn't smell much. It doesn't appeal to me anymore. So anyway, this one's almost gone. And then I had the whole Viraju set. 
my mom bought me. It came in a really cute hat box. Darling. So, um, sorry I lost you there. Got to move the mouse. I used one of them. I don't know why, but I threw it away. But you can still buy these at Sephora. So I have Love. Really cute. They have little brown, I mean, little wood. You pull them off. These are tiny. But the hat box was so cute. I wanted it so bad. So this one's called Love. It's full. My husband said, don't use those. Save those. It'll be worth money someday. We'll see. Anyway, this one's called Music. It's full. They're really cute. I don't know why I threw the hat box away, but I did. This one is called Baby. Really cute. I don't know what they smell like. I could smell each one of them and give you the notes, but anyway. And then, of course, I threw one of them. This is a Gwen Stefani one. This one's called Lil, Lil Angel. Really cute. So there's those four. And then I have one more. So let me start packing these in, and then I'll show you my body washes real quick. This is called Hippie Fizz by Moschino. I used to have the other one. I can't remember what it was called. I loved it. It was in black and red. It was called, it was by Moschino. It was cheap and chic. That was, that's what it was called. I loved it. This one's more of a lemony fragrance. I don't really like it. But in the summertime, it's perfect. You can throw it in the freezer. And this is a perfume. My husband bought it for me. It's a darling bottle. So I just, I really don't wear it in the winter. So let me put these back in here real quick. And we'll move on to my body sprays real, real quick and be done. Oh, and then I have the Baby Fat perfume. It had a ring around it that was rhinestones. This one really isn't one of my favorites. I don't know why. My husband bought it for me. It's pink. And he wasn't able to smell it. It was in a box. But it does smell good. So I need to use this up. It's pre getting pretty old. So there's that. And then I have some little perfumes. Let's go through these real quick. This is by Demeter which is a, a popular, this came in one of my last boxes. I don't know if it was Glossy Box. Yeah. No, this came in my, um, no, my look, look bag. Or my, anyway, one of my last boxes. This is called Apple Blossom by Demeter. And they make single, single note fragrances. So you can get like tomato, really strange, like cotton candy. They're not real complex fragrances so anyway this is apple blossom and it's a roll-on fragrance and you can see in the corner where it says Demeter so yeah you can get on the web get on Demeter.com and they have thousands of fragrances that are one note so anyway if you want to smell like uh, I don't know Apples, you can look up apples, and this is from Fortune Cookie Soaps. This is Cindy Lou Who. It came in their Christmas box. It smells fabulous. It's a very, very, very complex fragrance. I could not, I listed it once, it's on one of my videos, but it just smells very fresh. And it's a roll on, I carry it in my purse. And then this is, um, Estee Lauder, Estee Lauder Pleasures, just about gone. And this came in my birch box. This is live, learn, and love. This is live, live, learn, and love, I think. Yeah. So let's put these back real quick. Put the Tommy in back. And this is a sample. I'm not sure. Oh, this is philosophy. One of philosophy's samples from Sephora. Just found it in the corner. So that... That is my fragrance collection. It's pretty insane since Christmas. But by the time Christmas hits, I was down here. It was empty, and I made sure that I threw them all in the bathroom toilet, in the bathroom um, garbage can, so he knew I was missing one more. <laughs> kind of funny, but anyway. So the skulls and roses that needs to stay out, but I'll put it in here anyway if it'll fit. This Nicki Minaj is darling. I love it. All the bottles. I love the Viva. This has to show. That's darling. Everybody asks me every time I get this box out where I got it. I got it in Newport, Washington. It was in a gift shop that was closing down, so you can't buy them anymore. 
Oops, something fell. So there's my Nikki. Please stay up. Put the hairspray down. The Viva goes behind it. Uh oh, my fame won't fit in, so I'll have to take these out. The fame has to show. And then my skulls and roses I just set in the back on top because that is not my favorite. And then my little ones I have on a tray. So there's my perfumes. Uh oh, my Lady Gaga. That has to go in here too. I haven't opened it yet. Don't know what it looks like. It's so full I can't fit everything. I'm going to use up my... my. Um, you can walk through, honey. I'm going to use up my circus. Say hi to everybody. They can't see you, dear. I think he's going to go lay down. Anyway, so, yeah. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with these nails. If anybody wants to offer me a price for them, I may go for it. So, anyway, I am certainly not going to wear them. I know a lot of people have been on the hunt for these. But I'm not going to give them away either because I did pay for them. So... There is my perfume, <clears throat> and then I will go over my jewelry collection because I have quite a huge one. So there's the little tiny ones. I can't wait until we move and I have my own my own beauty room. I'm going to paint it pink. You can see my drawer is full of jewelry. It's insane. I mean, beautiful jewelry. I mean, this is my favorite bracelet, one of them. I know we're not doing jewelry, so anyway, we'll skip that. Okay, so let's do the body wash. So there's my husband again. He's a cigar connoisseur. Anyway, so let's go through these real quick. Now, he got me this for Christmas. This is called Flawless Gold by Paris Amore. And this is a dry powder. I know I reviewed this. But it smells fabulous, and it shoots miles. I love it. It's almost gone. I can't believe it. I've hardly worn any of it. So there's that. I have to go through these really quick because I have tons of them. Here is Twisted Peppermint. That's from Not This Christmas Last. I didn't use it all. Oh, my gosh. Here is Fortune Cookie Soaps. This is Body Wash. And then I have down here in my Nicki Minaj I think I have the lotion or it's in my the, the Viva La Juicy I love this Viva La Juicy canister let me uh, here's another Heavenly Shine perfume that I haven't used so I've got about nine of them we'll go through these real quick Pink Beach I got this at uh, Victoria's Secret and then here's my Paris Amour. It matches the spray. I have another spray too. And then here is my Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin, which I have a Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin up here. And then these two are, here's another Paris Amour. And then here is a Dark Kiss. That is very musky. If you can see the name, Dark Kiss. In Paris some more. I'm trying to get my room organized before we pack up and move. I'm buying a house. So before we pack up and move, I'm trying to get everything, all my makeup, my Mac. I have I counted and I have almost 20 glossy boxes. It's crazy. So I'm gonna get a P touch and label them, and I think I'm gonna do all my glosses in one, all my lipsticks, because they're stacked in a corner and there's nothing in them. It's crazy. So anyway, let's go over this. This is um, Passionate Kisses, Cherry and Vanilla from, Bi from Victoria's Secret. Um, this is Paris Amour from, I love the pink. I'm going to go get one of their candles. I love their candle, their pink candles, Paris Amour. There's the name. It smells fabulous. So I have the lotion, the body wash. This one is Signature Vanillas. Anything vanilla it says on the says on the back coconut. In the I put these in the fridge in the summer. Here's another. This is Vanilla Bean Noel. This is obviously different packaging. This is from last year. I don't know why I didn't wear them this Christmas. I must not have known I had them. Here are two. 
pink sugar plum. I know they're in different packaging this year. These are obviously from last year. I can't dump them together. There's too much in one of them. So I have two. Here's another sweet cinnamon pumpkin. Can't dump it into this one because the lid doesn't unscrew on this one. So, and I can't dump this one into this one. So anyway, I have to keep these and just use them. So those are all my sprays. This came in my test tube. This is called Memoir Liquid. And it smells very much like, um, it smells, I don't know if you can see the name. I don't know where you buy it. It came in the test tube when I was doing the beauty test, you know, all the beauty boxes. But this smells like pure vanilla. Anyway, there's that. Whoop, drop that. So there's those. I'm trying to get organized before we move. I haven't started packing. Oh, here's a cherry vanilla spray that went with the Passionate Kisses, the cherry vanilla lotion. It smells fabulous. So there's those. Some of them I have to put in upside down. This one needs to go in upside down. And then here's the Jessica Simpson. This is a perfume. I couldn't bring myself to throw it away. It's called Taste. You can't see it. It doesn't smell like anything, and it's supposed to be edible perfume. I don't know what, what possessed me to buy it. I thought I would try it, and it just is awful. So there's that. And then I put a few things in my... Here comes my hubby. Say hi. He's saying hi. Hi to all you alcoholics out there. <laughs> He's having a beer and a cigar. Hi to all New you. New Year's Eve. It's time New to Year's party. Eve. Yes. New Year's yes. Eve. It's time to party. I don't have a beer. So all those out there. All I have is a... New Year's. Yeah. Okay. Well, we got him to talk, so we're getting a little closer. Party yeah. On. Yeah, party on. It's going to be a fun night for me. I'm sure I'll be dragging him to bed at 5 o'clock. He hasn't had dinner yet. So anyway, inside this box, real quick, I have the... These are my lotions. Shea Terra Bananas and Bobas. I have reviewed this a million times. I've had this for a year. This came in my Beauty Army, and I bought it. It was $55. That's how much is left. It's insane. I use it a lot. It's a darling box. This is this came in my fortune cookie. It's called Peace, Peace Pinch of Grinch, and it's green. You can see the label. Whipped cream, Pinch of Grinch. I'm already up to 27 minutes. So here's a smell solid smell good. This is Tangle in the Tinsel. Come on, Dana. Solid smell good. Tangle in the tinsel. Smells just like Aqualina. Then here's uh, Carol's Daughter Ecstasy. This came in a glossy box. Haven't hardly used any of it. Yeah, it's full to the top. So then here's a sweet cinnamon pumpkin and a vanilla bean Noel I need to put in my purse. And then here's a Philosophy Snow Globe. Love it. I love it. This is not the same as their Angel, but it smells very close. So there's those. And then I have a whole ton of samples. Well, that's a whole other ch chicken fried nightmare. Anyway, we shall end this review. Now, I also have a lotion to match this body wash from Fortune Cookie Soaps. It's gotten wet, but this smells, this is Tangle and the Tinsel, smells just like pink sugar aqualina. So there's that. Put this back in here. So there you have it. That is my perfume and my body scent review. So I hope you guys re enjoyed this all. There it all is. I will upload this. Whoa. And I will do a what's in my purse or something else. I thought maybe I might pull out all my glossy boxes and show you guys just exactly how many I have. It's insane. And they're all empty, except my last one because I got shorted on products. But anyway, I thought this was a cute box, so when we move, I might just keep it. I don't think I'm going to recover it. And then I like my Nicki Minaj box. I thought they looked cute stacked on a shelf like this.
because they're both pink. But anyway, so yeah, that's a lot of fragrances. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. I There is way too many to list below. I'll just kind of put them in categories. Um, I did my makeup a little different today, but I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my high-low dress. Let me adjust this real quick. And, of course, I don't have a black shirt on. I just threw it on real quick. And um, if I back up, I don't have any light, but you can see how darling you can just wear it with like a denim jacket. I think I've kind of overworn that. Oh my goodness, I found some change. Wow, that's amazing. Oh, this is my, I was going to return this. This is my little um, Victoria's Secret keychain that I loved that I'm going to put on my new car. When I, when I get my new car, I'm going to put that on my keychain. Anyway, so... I hope you guys enjoyed this fragrance review, and I will be back with another upload hopefully soon. And I did, um, I did my waterline today. I read a new article, and it said when you wear like blue contacts, my eyes are normally hazel. It said to try. I lined them with black, and then um, I did my waterline in blue, and I think it looks beautiful. It brings your contacts out. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thanks for watching, and um, if you have any questions on where I got my chunky jewelry or whatever, you can ask me, and I will get back to you. So anyway, thanks for watching, and I will um, be posting another video soon, and I will talk to you later. Have a great evening, and stay safe. Stay home, probably, if you're going to drink. But anyway, and be 18, be 21, not 18. Thanks. Yeah, my husband said stay safe, too. And we will see you all later. Thanks for watching, and I will see you later on when I upload another video. My husband said drink a lot. No, don't listen to him. Thanks. Have a great night. Bye. Have a nice night. Have a nice night.